Good morning, George. How did you get here? I mean, how did you find my office? Good morning, big brother. You could at least offer me a seat before asking questions. Okay, brother. Have a seat. Welcome to America. Go straight to the point. Why are you doing here? Big brother. Why have you not been replying to my letters? I wrote over 20 letters to you. You did not even reply one. You know I am the founder of this company. I am a very busy person. You could have at least reply one. Or even sent a message across. If you did write back to me, I would not have paid a flight from Cameroon to this place. I am sorry for not replying to your letters. I apologized. Apology accepted. Now let's talk business. Brother I have been asking you to invest part of your wealth in real estate in Cameroon. But you completely ignore me. You have lots of millions here. You have totally forgotten about home. Why bro? George I told you to come work for me here in America. But you refuse. What else do you want me to do? Poor George. Haha. Ha. But brother. You know I don't like living abroad. I told you this since the last time you visited Cameroon in 2016. I completed university and I have a bachelor degree in real estate development. I really want you to invest in Cameroon. I don't have enough money to invest in your idea. I have many bills here to pay. And too many employees to manage. In fact I have lived most of my life here. I don't know what you are still doing back home. Come work for me and you will be fine. Forget about real estate in Cameroon. Bro I really want you to think about this idea. I know you can do this. Just believe me. This real estate will work and we will make lots of money from it. Brother don't forget home. I told our mother and she said you should reconsider this. Remember I'm your brother. Yes. You are my brother. And I know Cameroon is home. But I'm not gonna change my mind. I'll repeat come work for me. I will even make you the manager. Okay fine. If you don't want to invest lend me the money. I will pay back as soon as I start making profit. Look bro. America is hard. I have my wife and kids to take care of. I still have student loan and renting this office building is too expensive. I don't really have money as you think. Big bro. You drive an expensive car. You bought a luxury house. All your kids go to top universities in this country. Why are you refusing to help me? Your wife has never even worked all her life. But she drives a Ferrari. Don't talk about my wife and kids like that. I will not let you disrespect me in my office. I made you an offer. Either you take it now that you are here. Or go back home. Since you don't believe in my idea. I will go back to Cameroon. But don't forget your home. Big brother. Anyway mommy extend her greetings to your family. Hope her grandkids are doing okay? Yes. Her grandkids are doing good. It was nice meeting you again. I have to go now. Come home with me and spend the night. Before you travel tomorrow. Maybe you will change your mind. I will spend the night at a friend's house. Thank you. Before you go. Meet my manager at the front lobby. I asked him to give you a cash sum of $20,000. No. Thank you. That won't be necessary. I will be fine. Bye. If you don't want it. Take it to your mother. She will make use of it. Bye. Maybe George is right. Well, but at least I made him an offer. To come work for me. My son. I made your favorite dish. Rise and stew. Enjoy your food. I know you had a long flight hours. Thank you so much, Mama. Stop thinking about what happened between you and your brother in America. Everything will be fine. My son eat your food. I have some good news for you. I believe you will love it. Thank you again, Mama. You are best mother in the world. Good morning, Mama. Good morning, my son. How did you sleep? I slept so well, Mama. I hope you too. I slept well, my son. Thank you. The good news I promised last night is finally here. Can you guess? No, Mama. I am not very good at guessing. Just tell me. Your father left 10 hectares of land for you at mile 4. A company wants to buy 2 hectares of the land for 100 million. I think this money can help you start real estate properties. 
Our family lawyer has the land papers. I am very happy, Mama. This is more than good news. I will go meet the lawyer first thing tomorrow morning. Thank you again, Mama. You are welcome, my son. I want you to be happy.